Hello everyone and welcome back. We are looking for more quests to accept. I can't precisely remember where we left off because I uh, I'm having some brain issues today. <laughs> kind of kind of overworking myself just a little bit. We finally made it to Meridian, though. So, hooray for that. Oh yeah, that's right, we're supposed to, uh... We're supposed to go back to What's-Her-Face. Like to and see, uh, if she's hiding the sword. Kept that the thief stole. Day, it looks like the thief got away, but without the sword. I thought maybe he dropped it off somewhere. Like here, for instance? What? No. I had nothing to do with this. I guess we'll see when I get the city guard to toss your stall and question your customers. Uh, hold on. There's more to this. You've got a reputation for a shining light in the darkness, so I know you'll listen. You're right. The sword was passed to me, and I passed it on to someone else. It's going to be sold, but not for profit. The shards will go to people in need. Is you that so? Me to believe that. I can prove it. Meet my friends at the water mill in the lower village. They'll explain everything. If they don't convince you, come right back with the guards. I'm not going anywhere. It wouldn't matter if you did. I'd find you. <sighs> but all right. I'll check out the water mill. Okay. I guess I should go to this water mill then to find out what's going on. I smell an ambush. You'll like what I have for sale, I I'd like to discuss a trade with you, Outlander. Find goods for a fair price. So, there's a few quest givers I can't precisely reach. And that looks like one of them. Able bodied adventurers! Preferably with no friends or family, but I'm not choosy. Who are they? <laughs> Who are they? Oi there, Outlander. Name's Vilgund. Did you come to the city looking for work? You look oh, like a good pirate. Shards. Enough to buy garb more becoming of your... Okay, stop there, if you want me to hear you out. I, I only meant uh, a well-molded woman such as you. <clears throat> I heard an interesting rumor about a Banuke camp. Tame machines, the rumor said. So I, uh, I hired men to investigate. To just investigate, that's all. Those Banuke are canny, too canny. I paid up front. Well, uh, half up front. I I've had no word back. So now you're hiring someone to find the last men you hired. They're a sunk cost. This rumor's worth more to me. So, what do you want me to do? So is there any more to the rumor about this camp? <laughs> the last bunch just wanted to know about the reward. Hey, you're a smart one. This camp isn't even big enough for a name up where the snow won't thaw. They say the Banuk there live alongside machines. Peaceful as you like. Keep them, use them, sing to them. If it's true, if we learn how they do it, think how valuable that would be to all the tribes. When you say valuable, you mean they'd pay you for it. Girl, I'm not made of straw. <laughs> if I do You won't need to climb up the shoulders of the world for it. It's on the edge of Banuke land. Beneath the anvil of the moon. And you look like you know your way around the savage east. Uh, um, the east. Savage. If it's true they walk among machines without fear in this camp, well, you can't miss that, can you? Payment on return. I don't like the way you grin at me, buddy. Can I interest you in a reasonable share of a lucrative opportunity? They 
there's stuff up there. In there. I must find out what it is. Come on, can't I Assassin's Creed my way up there? Bagger. You'll sell me their services. No questions asked on my part. Aha, here we go. This is the Hunter's Lodge. Only members and invited guests are allowed in. How do I get invited? You've come all the way from the Savage East, right? You must have come across some of our hunting grounds. Each one has a set of hunting trials. If you pass a trial, you get an award called a Half Sun. Win three, and I'll let you in. I now have you three go. blazing suns. I'm not going home. No, <laughs> don't want to face my father. This is the Hunter's Lodge. Only members and invited guests are allowed in. But how do I get invited? You've come, each one. And now off you go. But I got three blazing suns. My family. The fuck? Don't I have three blazing suns? Oh my goodness. Alright, what resources can I get rid of? Sworn I had blazing suns. Oh, here we go, hunting grounds. Oh, are you kidding me? Of course, I didn't get that one. Kill grazers using the Kaja Crypt Tripcaster. Of course I didn't get that one. I needed the Karja Trip Costa. God damn it. Okay, so I have two blazing suns, that's good enough. I don't need your stupid club. I'm gonna go make my own fucking club. <laughs> Alright, now where's this new quest? Wait, I think I went the wrong way. That must be the spire. It's huge. Aha! Here it is. What's up, buddy? You're Nora. I'm the mournful Naman. My apologies that we meet like this. Like this? In grief. You hold yours close, like a talisman. Wait, forgive me. You didn't come for reparations? Someone you lost to the Sunring? Uh, no. I know about the Red Raids, but the Karja owe me nothing. I see. Well, I could use the help of a strong-willed Outlander. Then I would owe you very much indeed. 
These people seek to honor their loved, their lost, with their own voices, not mouthing Karja rituals to Karja stone. But there are obstacles. And while Meridian holds its breath for any disturbance, these robes only tie my hands. What? If I could help, what must be done? The first pilgrim is an Asaram who seeks to visit the Shrine of Kings on the road to the city. He waits there now, forbidden to enter by an old sun priest who suffer no heathen. This Utaro lost her companion on the edge of the jewel, at a pool where snap moths gather. The shrine was built there to ward off the machines, and its effectiveness leaves much to be desired. And the Manuk would paint a mark on the sun's climb, a call to the machine spirits, I understand. They need no beckoning. Glindhawks perched there, drawn to the spires shining. So, clear the machines out of two shrines and move a priest out of the other. All I can ask for is your charity and that their stories are heard. Yeah, sure, why not? I'll do what I can to help those in mourning. I'm in a generous mood today. Just to honor us all. <laughs> I'm in a very generous mood today. I am a generous god. I keep pushing fucking circle. Uh, I've been I've been playing too much uh, Fallout New Vegas. In New Vegas, you push circle to uh, you push circle to bring up the. Uh, uh, Boy, that's what it is. Everyone needs a splash of color in their lives. I need to play more. Let's uh, talk about nice. more Fallout. Ooh, hoo, hoo, what are you? The Mad Sun King. I shall read you later. Uh, whoops, wrong way. I don't think I've said it yet, so how are you peeps doing today? Everything, uh, peachy cane? If not, I hope this video perks you up even just a little bit. Brings you some of that, so, some of those, uh, good feels. And if not, then I don't know what you're fucking doing here. I'm trying my best. <laughs> my best is all I can do. And if it's not enough... Eat some food. Drink some tea. Eat some chocolate. Chocolate always makes things better. At least for me, anyway. Whoa, that's right. I got a... I got... Wow, they take... Blaze and shock stuff. Sticky... <gasps> Sticky bomb? Oh, yes! Blast bomb. Proximity ball. No, why? Wait, why can't I only have? Oh, oh no! What? I hear King Avad is too busy. Ah, I push circle again. To break the uh, crafting carry capacity. Blast sling ammo pouch. Are you fucking kidding me? Warbow Quiver! Oh, that is so fucking devious. Damn it! Fuck! I need more. I need much more. Uh, okay. Um, crafting. Quests. What are my errands? Uh, how do I abandon? Sharp show, abandon you. Uh, Tripcaster ammo. Requires fox skin. Traps. Turkey skin. Outfit satchel upgrade. What? Oh, that's so I can hold more weapons and ammo. No, I can abandon those. Uh... Okay. Um, God 
damn it, are you fucking serious? Okay, war bow, I need turkey skin. And for the blast sling ammo pouch, I need a rat bone. <sighs> what is that? Oh, that's corruption, okay. Alright, let me go ahead and craft these to max. And proximity bomb, blast bomb, st <laughs> sticky bomb. These are going to be fun to play around with. Yeah, let me go ahead and get more of these. Just so I have more. Proximity, blast, sticky. Wow. Okay, so the proximity and the blast difference is 25 points. But then between the blast and the sticky is a difference of 50 points. Well, that's pretty, pretty nice. Uh, what else can I do? I need to. Fuck! I push circle again. A fine day. I've played way too much. Uh, way too much Fortnite. <laughs> uh, crafting modify weapons. Okay, sharp short bow. I'm gonna clear your mods. And shadow sling. I'm gonna clear your mods. Um, what else? Okay, blast sling. Um, let me go with the shadow wall bow first. Uh, let me increase your freeze. Shock and damage. Corruption to... No, I'll do... So that'd be 37 frames. 70... No, I think I'm going to leave those as is. I think I'm going to go with more handling. That way I can knock the arrows significantly faster. Because 75 is quite a bit, with three arrows knocked. So yeah, let me go with handling on all three. Okay, so I'm at 98. 106, 116. I think that'll be 116. Yep, 116 handling. Perfect. And then you. Uh, what can we give you? Well, we can increase your damage significantly. 140 to... Wow. Okay, so let's give you one damage and then probably just the rest handling. Yeah. Fourteen handling, thirteen. Oh, that one has plus damage. Nah, I think I'll just go with just handling. And then that'll be sixty-seven. Yeah, sixty-seven. Perfect. All right, now to equip them in the right places. Uh, okay, Warbo. No, I'm back! Get back the Warbo. Okay, uh, 
all by fucking unequip you. Warbow equip you and put you on the right. Uh, blast sling, you're gonna go up. Okay, what else do I have? Rope caster. Rope caster, you're gonna go down. So that I know that you grab people. Um, probably change out the rope caster. Yeah, give you some better ones. There we go, now you're at 281 terror. Good god. Hell yeah. We are ready. Hell yeah. Let's uh, let's go ahead and save right quick. Wrong way. Gotta go this way. Wait, no, it was that one. That was the right way. Fucker. Sir, are you over here? Yeah, he's down here on the left. Sir. This must be the Shrine of Kings that Yaman told me about. It may have been meant for the Mad Sun King, but it's ours now. Hello there. It's a pub. You won't get in there. That dried-up old prune in a robe sees to that. I can be persuasive. But what does an Osram want with a Karja shrine, anyway? It reminds me of someone. Gone two years now. But what does a girl like you know of loss? Oh. Try me. You wanna I fucking a go there? Worked on monuments to their bastard king. Then he gave them a show in their sun ring for good measure. The Karja gave me back his broken bones, but what use are they? They won't build again. They won't make me smile. And seeing a statue of the Mad Sun King will? I, I need to see his work again. The marks his hands carved. The set of the metals they hammered. That's the soul of him. But that shriveled up old priest won't let me near it. I'll see what I can do. Well, fucking barge your way in, bar man. Every time I go near the statue, he shouts at me. Osram slaves uh -oh. built that thing. We deserve to have a look. <laughs> he looks like a dragon priest. Everyone stand back. Operator, cue the Jojo monument, music. Not his private shrine. Alright, you stress, stupid dragon priest. It's time for you to end. <laughs> Turn away, child. The abiding Jahaman wishes to be alone in his retreat. If you want to be alone, go someplace else. Others want to pray here. Defile it, you mean? Yet another debasement of what was once pure. Truly, our tribe has lost the light. Our king is false, our temple is corrupt, and our soldiers weak. The sun hastens across the sky for shame. What? So the Karja have become impure? What does that even mean? Is Meridian not meant for those who built it? Who made it great? It was pure before outlander squatters took it over. You mean Meridian was pure when the outsiders were in cages or dying in your arena? The sun is pure, child. It is not our place to question its divine will, only to act upon it. You sound like my friends who are praying to all mother. I thought Avad taking the throne was the son's will. The boy dishonored his father. Dishonored us all. 
To kill the Sun King. What shadow, what twilight time he brought upon us. And how many more would the mad Sun King have killed if Avad hadn't stopped him? The Sun called for blood. There was no choice but to obey. <laughs> Fucking Sun Bros, really? You called the temple corrupt, but aren't you one of its priests? They call themselves Sun Priests, but they have no authority. Youths and sycophants all. Yet those who gave their whole lives to the Sun's service are shamed and ignored. So that's what this is. A tantrum? A cry for attention? You know nothing of our rights, and yet you dare to insult me. Damn straight I do, buddy. <laughs> Why do you think your army is weak? Because you're not at war with everyone? A Karja throne relying on forged dirt mercenaries? Preposterous! The so-called liberation was nothing but a purge. Our most blessed warriors, chased out of the city, exiled to Sunfall and the Forbidden West. Our tribe is torn. The ones who walked in light now go by shadow. And yet everyone but you seems happy they're gone. Enough. I'm done arguing with you. Stay or go, but I won't allow you to keep others away. I am here by the will of the sun. Are you now? You have no authority here. You don't believe in the throne, the priesthood, the army, or the city, so I guess you have no authority here. I have the authority of the sun. Then call it for help. No one else will listen. There'll be a reckoning. You'll back away from it. <laughs> That's how you know you've done a good day for us. Get lost, dragon priest. The sun can't help you now. <laughs> You're welcome, buddy. He gave them the best work he'd ever do. And look at it now. They defaced it because they hated what it stood for. They defaced a thing slaves like him lived and died for. Slaves they've already forgotten. Short-sighted bastards the lot. If they thought their son set off this bridge, they'd jump after it. I thank you for honoring my wish. I hope you can find peace. I wouldn't know what to do with it any more than the Karja do. If to avoid it, sure you would, Mike. They dress a bit too fancy. I can help you find a wall. Figure out what to do with that new found piece. I promise. Although I don't always keep my promises, I'm kind of kind of forgive. <laughs> and what sort of quest is over here, I wonder? It's probably a DLC quest. Arrested two for disorderly conduct last night. Says, you don't want to know what they were doing, he says. What rumors are you talking about? Find out in the next episode, peeps. <laughs> Choose. How dangerous can it be? It's in the opposite direction of the Forbidden West. What's in the opposite direction of the Forbidden West? <laughs> I'm kind of curious now. I've waited four seasons for this, and I'm denied by Banu Doomsaying. 